How you feel about saying Robbie? How you feel about saying Robbie? How you feel about saying Robbie? Brother, I don't care, brother. Listen, listen, you guys want to sit and complain and critique RP all day? Like you can, man. Just do it on Reddit, bro. I'm sure they have a lot of wonderful things to say about criminals wanting to be criminals, man. I do. I think the mayor should get us under a lit fire and start protecting its people. Yeah, but that's an RP thing, brother. Yeah. What's up, Clark? Hi, Mr. Lang. Um, uh, we just got robbed. Just letting you know, I believe it's the same guys from before. How much you robbed uh, before? Took, uh, so Victor, you know, made some rookie moves and had 200 materials on him, and we had a, a good amount of recycle bills in the back. So, uh, of stuff we had to recycle. So probably, you know, around 500 materials. But Did they actually, the we just started. I, we're about to, we're about to call him. I just thought I'd update yeah, you real listen, quick you, first. You, look, call the cops before you even think about calling me. The, the only way these people are going to stop is two ways. One, the cops are constantly getting involved immediately. And two, um, unfortunately, we, we can't shoot our problems away uh, when the doctors are so great and everybody you know just gets patched up. We need yeah. to make them think that uh, robbing uh, us down there is not worth it. So if we got some of our guys walking around hundreds of materials, these guys are going to come rob us and be like, oh, my God, look, we just got 500 materials. Let's go f do this again. We need to create a system where when they come rob you guys, you guys don't even have two materials or even f any recyclables. You know what we should do? So when so if there's not enough people around straight up, just don't run. Just don't run sanitation. Um, All right. Yeah. Like y your life and your safety is way more important as a duo. You're, you're begging to be robbed. You know what I mean? Especially if, if a car of four or five pulls up. Um. Now, when you are with a full crew, what you guys should do is you should have one guy who's not in, who's not clocked in, but he's tagging along, and you guys just throw his recyclables in the car, and then he brings the recyclables somewhere and keeps it all stashed, and then we just do one big recycling uh, thing together. Yeah, I when think, I think we need to start coming up with systems that just make it not worth it for these guys, because uh, uh, if people uh, keep giving them materials, they're just never going to stop. I'm, I'm, I'm about to go down to the courthouse i'm gonna lose my mind if there's a mayor or a judge around as well so i'm gonna go bitch some people out for you oh thank you so much mr lang no okay i'm gonna i'm gonna call the cops okay yeah you're all good though yeah 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 i'm good i'm did good take your, i just uh, you know did they take your phone and shit anything like that oh thank god they didn't all right i'm gonna go i'm gonna go down to the courthouse i'm gonna i'm over the shit i'm gonna go lose my mind i'll give you a call perfect okay? all right sounds good bye-bye right, bye -bye. where's our mayor man i gotta pull out karen lang dude hey, excuse me is there useless mayor around by any chance no any of his uh, uh, any of his associates, the Council of Eight. Um, let's see here. I was hoping to see him as well. Oh, let me guess. You're getting robbed and stabbed. Uh, the cops ain't doing anything, th anything about it. The mayor don't give a shit as well, uh, man. That is correct. Dang. I've been robbed and stabbed twice in the last hour. As a matter of fact. Damn, it's crazy. And when we have to rely yeah. on our gracious mayor and this council of ain't to do something about it, they somehow are never around. Uh, I can pass Insane. you the PD representative's number if you want to, if it's a- Is PD this person system. in the council? Yeah. Oh yeah, I would love that. Please. Thank you so much. Appreciate that. Sir, may I, may I ride with you? <laughs> oh, I'm going to call. I'm going to give a piece of my mind over the phone. I don't know what, what issue are you what looking to bring up to with the, uh, with the mayor? Uh, everybody and their mother that's trying to work an honest job, attempting to make an honest living is getting robbed on the hour, every fucking hour. There's nothing we can do about it. There's no face or person we can fucking turn to in hope of get, maybe getting some help, maybe some gun licenses, maybe some new legislation, some laws fucking passed. We got to sit around with our fucking thumb up our ass and pretend this fucking council of eight and this useless fucking mayor does some of the fucking time that they have. Oh, I understand your frustration. So uh, what, I'm, what I'm hearing right now is that your main concern is that sanitation is basically uh, like a piggy bank that's getting smashed open every day. It's uh, not only on sanitation, repeat. my man. It, it's group six. It's fucking grind. Yep. Criminals are running, running rampant, doing whatever the fuck they want. And nothing seems to be happening to these motherfuckers. And so they keep doing it because they're profiting more than what they're fucking losing. I I understand. Uh, I'm. Can I ask you a question? What, what, what would you like to see uh, have happen if you have any like concrete idea right off the top of your head you pass the law protect your people constant serial fucking robberies of any fucking honest working citizen working for a job that is provided by the government you are thrown in jail for fucking years and you get a fine so fucking big your fucking ancestors couldn't pay for it you're in debt yeah, for eternal fucking life have you read the ego act uh, sir i don't know what the fuck that is I'd recommend you go you go read that one because that's uh, quite literally what you're asking for. It's already been passed. 
So are, are you as the PD? Are you, are you guys enacting the whatever this fuck this, this act is? Uh, yeah, we are. We have the capability to enact it. That is correct. Okay, having the capability and actually doing it are very two different things, man. I don't disagree with you. But which one's happening? Is it not happening, or is it, or is it happening? I'm confused. We, we, we have the power to enact it. We just need to, uh, you know, follow the uh, parameters of the law itself in order to enact it. What are the parameters, if you don't mind me asking? Uh, I believe it is uh, individuals who are caught in three separate instances of targeted violence against a group, an individual, or a business. And what's like the time frame of them being caught within the day, within the week, within the month, within the year? Uh, statute of limitations is 30 days. So any person caught robbing somebody on multiple fucking occasions, what then happens after that? Three times in 30 days, uh, it goes before a judge. They, uh, they get all the facts of the cases, and uh, then they sentence them to a very lengthy uh, sentence, presumably, based on the way the legislation has been written. And the sentence is based on what the judge decides? The judge will rule, yeah, based on severity, and that's part of the facts coming in. Okay, and how many people have been, uh, you know, uh, have this enacted upon them? Uh, to my knowledge, I don't know of any right now, but it's only been active for a week. The only no. thing I'll, I, I will say, sir, uh, one thing, and I, I, are you, you're fairly active at, at the uh, sanitation yard, I'm assuming? Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm the only active crew still willing to waste our fucking times to be down or to provide a service for the fucking city, my man. All right. No, no, I, I understand that. Uh, the only thing I will say is of people of your crew, one, one obstacle that we are sort of having is um, people are not always uh, willing to come forward with information that could potentially help us push legislation like the ego act uh yeah probably because they're deathly scared that the you know how easy it is for somebody to target and uh you know harass assault or kill them sir with all due respect they probably don't feel protected enough to fucking come forward right but you also see the uh, uh the conundrum you have me in though is you're calling us for results and i'm telling you that it's hard to get them based on the way people are, are giving us information well, what results situation. are you looking for are we victim blaming right now is that what we're doing i would never victim blame sir what are we doing right now? I want to work with the people who are being targeted to help put the scumbags who are targeting them behind bars. Yeah, go go knock on Chang Gang's door, my man. They're robbing everybody in their fucking mother down in the sanitation yard every chance they get. And while you're knocking on their fucking door, go knock on Jean Paul's door too, my man. Is that the information you want? Jean Paul, big headed fucking, big, big fucking nose. Big fucking nose, tiny head, a lot of fucking yellow hair. Big fucking nose, tiny head, okay. Apparently, he was arrested last night. Oh, I'm so happy he was arrested sex. for about 16 months last night. Let go back on the streets and do the same exact thing again. I'm so happy that something's being done about it. Probably got hit with like a $300 fine as well, I would assume. Uh, no, from what Captain Slacks is saying, it was a pretty significant uh, arrest. No, you give, you, How significant are we talking here? Well, I can't divulge police reports to you, obviously. That would be a, a dereliction of my duty. But from what Captain Slacks is telling me, it was quite a financial and time-sensitive uh, burden on him. Okay. Well, I don't think. But got what was this so. other thing you said? Chain gang. Chain gang. Yes. I just made the suggestions, Doug. I'm okay. Citizen. What? Uh. Who, There's a reason I'm not. On do we have individuals to make up this group that you know about? Uh. Yeah. Mr. K. Rami Al. Mr. Hahim. K. Uh, Wait. The lawyer. Yeah. The fucking lawyer, my man. The fucking lawyer, my man. Rami, the lawyer, is in a gang. Yes. Jesus Christ. Okay, that's two. You got anybody else? Uh, Vinny Pistone. This is the type. This is the type of information we're looking for, sir. If you if you can keep this coming, this is going to be really good for the PD. I'm not going to lie to you. You see, but you know how much danger you put me in, and I know this is going to get leaked back to them somehow. No, somewhere. it is it it is not because I do not operate in that fashion. I know uh, you don't know me too well, uh, Mr. Lang, but uh, I, I I'm not a I'm not a leaker. Well, I already I mean, gave you the three biggest names and the people fucking involved, sir. I'm begging that you fucking do something about it before I have to take matters into my own fucking hands. And my perfect, beautiful, honest life, being a garbage man, is thrown away because of my frustrations internally that cannot be solved externally by the people who were put in place to solve them. All right. I understand your frustrations, and I definitely would not want to put your perfectly beautiful life as a garbage man in jeopardy. So Thank I will uh, I will use this information, no, and uh, we will act on it accordingly. But Captain Slacks is coming down there to, to talk to you. So Thank you so much. Appreciate that. All right. All right. Talk to you later. It's been a while since we got Karen Lang chat.